All right, this is the fog machine chiller. We're having trouble with the fog at our dances. We haven't set off a fire alarm, but oh, I think we've come very, very close. And so I'm trying to create a way to have the kids dance in basically a pool of fog. And the only way to do that is to cool it. So this is an insulated garbage can. And at the moment, I just have a bucket of slush down in there. But uh, it's designed for uh, dry ice. And so the dry ice will just cool this entire area and hopefully super cool the pipe. And then it has a pair of switches on the side. The, the lighted switch is the main one, so that I know that the unit is on. This one is, is just for fun. What it does is it turns on a kid's nightlight. With luck, it'll light the fog, and if it doesn't light the fog, it'll it'll be neat in the corner. And then this turns on a very small fan back up inside there. Now, when it's running with dry ice, that very small fan will pump the dry ice fog out more or less continuously. The fog comes in right here. Fan blows across it. I'm hoping to get some sort of Venturi type action. I don't know if it'll work or not. But here's its first test, putting on the fog. Well, yeah. even though I haven't got the dry ice in there, so it's not very cold, it does seem to uh, put the fog down along the floor. Now I'll kick on that fan. Like I said, when it's running dry ice, that fan pulls from the inside. So all the stuff that spills out over the top will end up down in there. In my mind, that's a pretty mediocre test. It's quite a bit of work if it doesn't uh, do what it's supposed to. Guess we'll have to buy dry ice and find out.